Richard. Yes. Do you have any large companies here, like Walmart or Costco? Oh, you're from talking America? about you're talking about our supermarkets. Yeah. So we have a supermarket called Asda, which is throughout the UK, and that's owned by Walmart. We don't have Walmart. We don't have Kmart. We don't have Target. Yeah. We don't have Best Buy. We don't have Costco. No, we don't have those no, here. No. We have equivalents. Yeah. You know. And groceries, you have Lidl or Lidl. Li Lidl. Lidl. Or Lidl or Lidl. Okay. Yes, and you're just getting that in the States, aren't you? Yes, we've got it. And uh, all these? Well, they've Aldi. got Aldi in the rest of the United Kingdom and the Irish Republic, but we don't have it. No, not yet. Northern Ireland's the only place in the British Isles that doesn't have it. But and little, little is very comparable to uh, Aldi's. It is indeed, yes. Yeah, they're yes. very similar, I think. Yes. We've got Tesco's, Sainsbury's, Marks and Spencer's, etc. over here in Northern uh -huh. Ireland. Tesco's and Sainsbury's only came here after 1998, but we always had Marks and Spencer's. In fact, the Marks and Spencer's food hall store in the centre of Belfast was the busiest in the whole of the United Kingdom. So I do want to emphasise to you that even though we had the period of the Troubles, and you would have seen those like in actually a lot of wealth here in Northern Ireland as well, there was a uh, survey done a number of years back and there is quite a lot of wealth here in Northern Ireland as well. So on the right here you have Panda China. Do you have, um, what would be the number of Asians <coughs> that live in Northern Ireland? Do you know a percentage? Well, well, well I can't give you a watch the grave, but I would encourage you, you know, to go straight into the cathedral. Then they can start the little chat, get that over with, and then you can wander around, okay? Once again, and I'm going to emphasize this one more time, at the grave itself, the ground is very, very uneven, and it is quite easy to slip. So just be very, very careful there, all right? Um, we'll be good. You better be good. <laughs> and we'll be back on the coach for 11.40, if possible, and then we'll make our little drive to Saul Church. So the thing I like about St. Patrick's grave is he's one of the most famous saints throughout the entire world. Yes. If this was in another country, they would have a glass case around his grave, which is fundamentally a great big slab of stone, okay? They would have a great big case around it and lights. It's not like that. It's just a slab of stone on the side of a hill. But I think it's all the better for its yes. simplicity. Yes. And... Here's the other thing. Remember I said there were some extras today? So you're going to get three saints for the price of one. <gasps> because there are three Bridget saints together. that are buried in there. St. Bridget and St. Columba, also known as St. Columcu. Yes. So, I mean, you don't often get to hear the, the phrase, three saints for the price of one. <laughs> um, but yes, they're all buried in the same grave. So we're just stuck in the traffic here, obviously, in downtown Don Patrick. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, Saturday, it's a bit busier. Oh, it's, it's crazy, isn't it? It's, just, it's gone wild. Feral, feral Don Patrick. I was dead. Richard? Yes? Many people, particularly the young people, smoke. No. Good. Uh, there are less people that smoke nowadays. Because um, we've had uh, trouble with the vaping. Oh, the yeah. kids are doing the vaping well, and they're yeah, trying to eradicate it. Lots of people do vaping. Yeah. That is something that happens. And it's worse. Apparently, it's worse for you, isn't it? Oh, yes. yeah. That's what they say. Much higher uh, uh, attitude. No, really? you, you might notice that I cough. I cough. I've got quite a chesty cough. That's because I have a weak chest because my mother and my brother were heavy smokers. So I did a lot of passive smoking. I've never smoked, yes. but I've got a smoker's cough. I did a lot of passive smoking whenever I was yes. growing up. So that I get a chest infection really easy, and I have a weakness in my chest. So yeah. there you go. Yeah, we Something 